ensuring access to services and justice for child victims of sexual violence. In 2019, Myanmar raised the age of marriage for both males and females to 18 in the new child rights law, which is expected to help reduce marital rape and domestic violence. However, there were nearly 2,000 child rape cases in 2016 and 2017. Among the rape cases, 671 occurred in 2017 and increased to 892 in 2018, according to the data from the Ministry of Home Affairs. Survivors of sexual violence cases struggle to access justice due to corruption in the judicial system and the costly and lengthy judicial processes involved in convicting a perpetrator. Making the matter worse is that survivors bear the blame and shame due to negative attitudes of society towards them. In Myanmar, case management systems have been established in only 49 townships out of 330. And only 100 government and NGO social work case managers were trained by 2018. Child-focused organizations in Myanmar have insufficient resources to respond effectively to child rape cases. Thus, there is limited support for case managers and limited financial resources to respond to sexual violence cases on time within 72 hours. Government case managers who are staff of the Department of Social Welfare are overworked and township coordination mechanisms that are supposed to give support for the victims are not functioning. We recommend the following. One, take effective and timely action against perpetrators by coordinating among the responsible ministerial departments, such as health, police force, courts, and social welfare. Two, Expand the case management system and provide adequate support for case managers to respond effectively to child sexual violence cases in a timely manner. Three, ensure that coping mechanisms such as psychological support and social reintegration measures are in place for girls and boys who have experienced sexual abuse and trauma.